Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel Entertainment Evolution. In the last few episodes, we spoke about how technology has changed entertainment, how the pandemic has changed entertainment, and how social media has changed entertainment. In our last episode, we had a special interview as it was part one of our finale. Today is part two of our finale. Now, because this is the last episode, to round things up, we'll be covering what the future of entertainment in general could look like. Hopefully you have a brief understanding of just how much entertainment has changed throughout the years because of this series. It's clear that entertainment is constantly evolving. We've transitioned from the iPod Shuffle to your Spotify subscription, from Tetris to VR games and from black and white films to HD coloured film. First of all, we'll start off with what the future of sports could look like, since we've not covered anything about sports yet in this series. Something that not many people know is that there's a technological impact on athletes and their sports now. The way fans view sports and how athletes prepare for competition is changing as the integration of virtual reality is transforming consumers' experiences by creating a sense of closeness to an athlete or game. Because of the pandemic, from now on when athletes partake in sports, there will be more precautions taken beforehand. Not to mention there's also a growth in the rise of esports. Esports is a form of competition using video games and the growing world of esports may be virtual but the money made is very much real. For example, the world's most valuable esports competition team and company is worth around £310 million. It is said that the future of esports will continue to grow and overtake traditional sports content. Speaking of video games, the fees. Firstly, PlayStation 5, Xbox and Microsoft's next generation gaming consoles will offer faster processors, 60 FPS frame rates and true 4K graphics, possibly then transitioning to 8K in further future. We can also expect a legacy gaming industry developers like Nintendo to continue innovating products, offering something different in the future. There will also be an increase in VR games as there's been a big success when it comes to VR. The Oculus Quest and PlayStation VR are some of the options that offer gaming a truly immersive experience and that has led for more VR to be made. Now moving on, the future of music is also looking very interesting. We've covered the how the pandemic has changed music already so you may already know just how much it has innovated. However, the future of music is definitely going to be more AI based and more computer based. As the years go on, technology improves the engineering of music, which makes it easier. However, since we've covered music and technology as a topic already, to save you guys from listening to the same thing over and over again, as part of the finale of our series, we've got another interview. I will be interviewing an upcoming artist since we're on the topic of music. Hello, my name is Samuel, artist named Ski, producer named Ski Productions. I want to be a producer, sound engineer, songwriter, and artist. What first got you into music? And the way I got into music was I was picking my A-levels. So all that music technology, music production was an option. And I've like, realised that I've always been kind of making music and writing just as like a therapeutic method. And um, I kind of realised as well that I was always growing up around people making music and just always listening to good music through different genres and I decided to start learning music theory, learn how to, to play the piano, get vocal training and yeah that's basically how I got into it. How would you describe the music you typically make? I would say I mostly create UK rap, UK Afro swing or kind of UK slash American R&B type of songs. If you had the chance to collaborate with someone in the music industry, who would it be? If I was to collab with any artist, it would either be her or Dave. Hopefully you enjoyed learning about an upcoming artist. As you know, we've been holding a big competition here at Entertainment Evolution. Today is our final episode, so the winners will be announced. The winners are... At Sophie12 and at JackSmith1. You guys will now be the owners of the items that are on screen. And as for the rest of you guys, I'd like to say a big thank you for submitting your answers on Twitter and partaking. And also a big thank you for watching. 
And that's a wrap for the series. Until next time, guys. Thanks for watching.